Hello YouTubers, welcome back to the Dennis Bloodknock channel. Now this video is my review of the Nikon D780 DSLR camera. The Nikon D780 is the camera which is right now recording me. It is the A camera. And the Nikon D780 is the direct replacement for the Nikon D750 which is my B camera, which is recording me right now. Anyway, let us get into the introduction and then let us get into the main part of this video. Hi, I'm Rui. Hello, I'm Denise. Hi, I'm Lily. And welcome, welcome to the Dennis Bloodlock channel. Hi, I'm Rui. Hello, I'm Denise. Hi, I'm Lily. And this is a review of the Nikon D780. Well, YouTubers, the Nikon D780, this is a 24 megapixel DSLR, which is capable of shooting both 1080p and also 4K at up to 30 frames per second. This camera, the Nikon D780, is the replacement for the Nikon D750. The Nikon D780 is the latest DSLR in Nikon's range of full-frame DSLR cameras. Now, in particular, when using this camera during a photo shoot, at a studio with models, one of the first things that I found with regard to the D780 in comparison to its predecessor, the D750, is if you are on single shot mode, on the D750 there is a delay during the time whilst the most recent image is being written to the card. When using the D780, there is no delay. Even if you swap the cards over and use exactly the same card that you were previously using on the D750, on the D780, it goes from shot to shot to shot like, like that. No delay at all. Whereas on the previous D750, it was shot, bit of a delay, then the next shot, then a bit more of a delay, then the next shot and so on. So that is one of the definite improvements of the D780, less delay time between shots and of course the 4K video. The D750, the predecessor, was only capable of 1080p. Anyway, let's get into the gallery and then we will get on to the next part of the video. Well, YouTubers, a comparison of the video quality between the Nikon D780, here recording me at 4K at 30 frames per second, and the Nikon D750 recording me at 1080p at 50 frames per second. The other particular differences between the two cameras the D750 is using the 85mm 
f1.8 lens at f2.8 and the Nikon D780 is using the 50mm f1.4 lens also at f2.8. The D780 is at 640 ISO and the D750 is at 1000 ISO. So see what you think with regard to these two bits of footage and furthermore here is some 1080p footage from both cameras shot in a studio in my most recent photo shoot with models and as with right now the D780 has the 50mm lens and the D750 has the 85mm lens. So see what you think in video footage comparison when both cameras are at 1080p. Hi, I'm Rui. Hello, I'm Denise. Hi, I'm Lily. And this is a review of the Nikon D780. Do it once more. <laughs> it's okay, baby. <laughs> Hi, I'm Rui. Hello, I'm Denise. Hi, I'm Lily. And this is a review of the Nikon D780. Brilliant. Many thanks, ladies. You're welcome. Hi, I'm Rue. Hello, I'm Denise. Hi, I'm Lily. And, and this is a review of the Nikon D780. Do it once more. It's <laughs> okay, baby. <laughs> Hi, I'm Rue. Hello, I'm Denise. Hi, I'm Lily. And this is a review of the Nikon D780.